Hi guys, it's Maddie here and welcome back to Honkai Star Rail. Whether you're close behind a level wall or you want to face harder content, here's five best ways to keep leveling up. Alright, first things first is your dailies. Do your daily trainings every day. Depending on which activities you can do, you can get a certain amount of activity points right here. And you only need 500 a day. So it's something as simple as taking a photo or using consumables that will net you and you do that, you know, you get all your things right here. That's, and you get like 200 each one. That's a thousand XP right there, baby. All right. The next thing you can do is Calyxes. You fight a certain amount of waves of enemies. Max you could do is six at a time, which helps progress it faster. And then they cost 10 resin or your trailblaze power. And each one that you do over here will give you 50 XP. Do that out of the 180 times that you get it <laughs> and then you get 900 xp it's just simple as that on to the next way to get xp go up here and you hit the next tab to your left is your operation briefings your operation briefings for up to a certain amount they're just little side quest missions i guess you could say or like objectives and they'll give you XP up to a certain point. I've, I'm still receiving XP on part six of the operation briefing. So I don't know when the exact cutoff is, but look at how much XP you get. You, you're basically getting a hundred for each mission that you complete. And that's like about five each. So up to a certain point, it helps with XP grinding. Now, if you follow me here to the space station, you go to your simulated universes. So each world that you do will give you 600 XP for your first completion. Now, after you've done your first clear and you get the object, you get your XP. There's no real reason to keep going if you've done your whole score for the whole week, but you are still allowed to come back and grind these materials if you'd like to do so. And last but not least is missions. You have ranging from your actual story missions, companion missions, or your adventure side quests. You can always preview the rewards down here, but most of your XP is going to be coming from your main missions right here. Besides that, always take a gander, and if you're not really a side quest kind of guy or gal, go ahead and just check here and do the ones that give you XP. If you enjoyed the video or it helped you out, please like and leave a comment. Make sure you subscribe for more. Honkai Star Real, Nikkei in the future, Blue Archive in the future, <laughs> and Genshin eventually. Videos. Bye bye.